Okay, here's a little app for those of you who probably use YouTube and, you know, you have the ability to change the thumbnail, you know, being a YouTube partner. Or maybe if you want to put, like, a little screenshot of your video somewhere in from your video, you know, kind of like a teaser for your viewers on your website. It's called Screenix. I am, hopefully I'm saying it right, too, oddly enough. Um, pretty much what it does is it just takes a video scans it pretty much and then it makes like a image from most of the screens from the frames and then it makes like a screenshot like a, a screen capture of each typical frame or so and here's how it looks see pretty simple uh, preferences <clears throat> maximum uh, operators for whatever you could change it to the desktop you could change it to wherever you want to put it same as the video, which, you know, in some cases, you might want to do just in case, but I usually just put it to the desktop. Uh, you can change it from PNG to JPG, JPEG, actually. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, number of rows, you can change that. Space between thumbnails. Image file width, you can change how, basically, you can change the width of the image. Change the background color, shadow color, movie information color, whatever, you know. You go nuts pretty much with this here. So let me show you how it works real quick. Now I drag my video that I had up here. Something seems off, which you can see on YouTube, which is kind of like a odd, funny video. See, it's already done. Now you can see this. It popped up right here. Here's what it looks like. So from within all of these here, I could choose one of these to put on like my website if I wanted to, or maybe use it as a thumbnail on YouTube. And kind of like you know, you know, pretty much they almost look the same, but still, I could use one of them, pretty much if I wanted to. And you know, you probably seen, you probably depending on what sites you go to, you probably seen uh, this type of image before. So if you've seen it, now you know how it's made. But yeah, it's pretty, it's free. Again, you can get it from Mac Update, and I'll post, and I got the link in the description. Uh, it's free, you know. It don't take that long. It's not going to convert anything. It's just going to take screenshots, basically, of the of so many frames. And you know, actually, I don't know exactly how many frames it takes. Actually, it looks like maybe about like every two or three other frames or so, maybe depending on. I, I imagine depending on the video, but pretty much, you know, uh, very simple, very easy. You know, not that. It don't really do anything, really. It, it just makes the images for you. All you gotta do is just edit and cut it out and upload it. So yeah, that's Screenix. Get it at MacUpdate.com.